Hello, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back. My name is Buddy702 and today we are on the Skycade server. It has been very, very long time since I've been on here. Last time I was on here, I was doing my Skyblock Survival Series and didn't quite finish it off. I've still got unrecorded clips on my computer of progress that I have done that may be released eventually. First things first, I've noticed that the spawn... Is, it, is this different? I'm not sure if it's different or not. But I noticed that people have got like little zeros next to their name. No idea what that is. But I thought I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to check out the lovely... What's it called? SMP server. So let's go ahead and... It doesn't even fit on my... This one doesn't even fit on my screen. What's that supposed to do? I can't even read what it says. Okay, let's just go ahead. Oh, I can just click on it. The, there we go. Let's hop into the SNP server. How, how do I do this? There we go. Connecting to SNP. There we go. Whoop. Oh, shit. There's a lot of people online. I did not expect... Well, first off, this is a... Whoa. This is a new spawn anyway. Explore spawn to find out portals. And Oh, yes, I do have that installed. There is um, a, lot, a lot of gear that I've got there, isn't it? Now, let's just get all this stuff in position. This is obviously a, cl claiming, a claiming one there. So... Oh, it's all, it's all invisible locks there. So can I go slash wild? Let's, let's go that there. How far away am I from spawn? Quite a few blocks. Can I do slash near and all these bits? Why oh, can't you do slash near? I don't have a rank on here, do I? I don't think I do. Um, this is a very... <laughs> this is all cust horrible custom terrain stuff. Um, how does that go? Okay, so they don't have tree falling on this one. Okay, I haven't played survival for a long time, and I thought it would just be a normal survival map, but no, it appears to be all completely custom. Which is really, really fun to do. Because I've played custom maps before, and they're, they're not fun. Because they're like ore spawning, and it's normally all completely different. But I really have no idea what it's doing. My balance is zero dollars, which is okay. I'll take that cactus in. Why not? Okay. So no one's obviously been here because they're just exploding all over the places with the slabs, trying to make it nice and more slopey like, or whatever you may call it. I'm going to go ahead and explore and see if there's anything around that is of interest. And I'll be back with you guys shortly. Okay, so after quite a while of exploring, well, actually just 30 seconds, I think I'm going to go ahead and look at the shop. Surely, surely I can just go slash shop, warp, shop, maybe? And there we go. Oh, there's a shop here. And it appears to be just a... Sell all items, grind, grind, grind. So it's so it's just like Skycade then reward 0 0.4 money. Buy items. Elytras will be pretty expensive. It seems pretty um basic, doesn't it? Like these here, you can automate these, obviously. But it's, yeah, it's not really the, surely there's got to be other places to go on here, like a warps list. Also, warp mining, m -in mining world, let's see, teleport to mining world, P PvP is enabled here, no clients. Um, I don't, I don't want to lose my sass, is it EC? End chest, let's just chuck everything I own in there and let's pop through into this mining world just so I don't lose everything that I've definitely worked hard for. 
So let's go slash near. So I'm not only one, so it's just pretty much a normal world. It must be. With mobs. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I I, I have no no clue how to really play this. So obviously you just hold up a stand anyway, so you can't walk there's got to be player shops slash Yeah, I don't know, slash spawn maybe. It might get me back there. So, oh, I could I could just help with uh, reading reading the commands, eh? That could that could definitely help. In the chest, yep, SMP, thank you. Warps, mining near the crates. Warp shop and mining wheel. Beautiful. I thought I'd have some keys, but they obviously don't carry around onto this here. So let's just explore the foot this the, the bear. So let's just go around and explore the spawn. So this is obviously my little mermaid that Phil getting a lovely treasure. Some sharks or whales up there for the lovely ocean update. So I obviously just updated this a while back when that came around. But anyway, kit starter, start exploring slash wild wild portals. Beautiful. And what is this over here? World borders. 20,000, 20,000. Okay, good information to know. What have we got over here? No claims. To end, okay. To the nether, yep. And I think that's everything here, obviously. There you go, people. You just seen that just there. We've now got the reset. With the, reset. the world was reset two days ago, which is pretty. You can see me just doing my bad little bits of typing there. Response. Yeah, jeez, I definitely know how to spell that. Nice and perfect. So this is quite a good way to start off. So let's just swim along here and try and find a spot, I suppose, since it shouldn't be two covered in houses. Because I just had a wet look at F3 before and it said day 50, so two days ago it's had a reset, so that's pretty good. So I might do a, the odd episode on here, or see just how it goes. Because I'll, I'll try and figure out how it all works, so I'll do my, my little bit of voting. This is quite a large ocean, what does it say? Savannah, birch, okay so it's got no, really, no real set biomes. So I'm just going to swim along until I just find something really. And my goal for today is to try and find a little bit of land and I suppose claim some. Because as soon as we claim some land, then we can start work on a whole lot of little farms and start rolling in the cash. Can I do bell top on this? Some people are already rolling in the cash, definitely. Look at that. Sick Bree is number one at the top. They obviously got straight into building their farms. But lots of people have no lives and just spend a long time on here doing pretty much um, just pretty much just sitting on here and playing what's it called? Skycade constantly. So this is again the server play.skycade.net. I might put a little thing on screen there. But this is the server and the and the content that gives me the most views. Pretty much, and it's also the thing that's the most painful to play because I get lag for some reason because my computer does not like connecting to wherever these servers are in the world. It's quite a bit hard to read the text as well, but I'm hoping to in the next few weeks to have the replay mod out, which we can then use to build ourselves some lovely, I suppose some lovely visions on when I do my single player survival island which I really want to get starting to work on oh yeah I want to get start work on that there this looks like a very flat boring island I don't want to be flat and boring let's just jump along and see if we can find some other trees because I don't really this birch doesn't tickle my fancy really so let's see if there's anything else along here. Anything more interesting? Got plenty of sheep in that there for food. 
So let's just try and find anything else along here. Not, not, not really, eh? Let me try and find a place. I'm gonna probably just jump along, looking for some places, and I'll see you guys. Ooh, what, 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 want to find a place and hopefully not lag out too much. See you then. Okay, everyone, I have found a lovely little tiny parrot here, and I think I'm getting closer to a place that looks like it'll be okay for me to live. They, they eat seeds, right? There we go. We've got best friends forever, and we have got ourselves a lovely little parrot there. So, oh, oh there's, another, there's another parrot down there. Let's try not to die, and let, let's see if we can get another friend. Come on, come on. Do you want to, do you want to eat? No. Do you, do, you, do you eat watermelon? Do you eat watermelon? Okay, let, let's chuck a couple into those seeds. Oh. Come on, I want a little friend to hang around with me. I suppose I've already got one, but I still want, I just want to get another one. Hopefully this here is not too loud, because I should have readjusted the volume so you guys could actually hear what I'm saying. So let's go down here, and let's see if we can get ourselves another friend. No. Okay. okay. Nice meeting you. And you know, let's keep exploring and try and find ourselves a lovely position to live in. I'm just trying to find a little island sort of place. So we can still do a little shack. We're around lovely spruce trees here, which is quite nice. But I want to be somewhere so it's a little bit open, not, not too surrounded by trees. But I suppose we can always chop things down. It seems like a nice little like a little bay in here. We've got little hills over there, so it's a nice little area through here. We can do probably most of the farms will be underneath the ground anyway. We could do something hidden in the tree hill here maybe. I, I really I really have no idea because I wasn't really planning to actually start working on this world. But since it's new, we may as well do something little on here. So we've got a, okay, so we've got a nice hill going here. Going back in, let's just see how far back this goes before I start building anything. It looks like the world has stopped generating there. Oop, it's generated in. And we have a lovely mesa biome just here. So we're just gonna stay around the side, I think. Just so it's not as ugly. Not as ugly, not not too much ugliness to it. So let's go down around here and just see that. My, my, that was my phone just going off. So, yep. Let's try and find a place to build, and I'll be back, you guys, in a tick. Okay, everyone. As you can see, it has been quite some time since the last clip. I finished recording after quite a while, and. Started piecing together the video and the audio is just bad. I'll play a little clip right now so you can hear what the audio sounds like. Okay everyone, it has been some time and I've collected a bunch of wood, a couple of spruce saplings, which that is pretty bad, isn't it? It's I don't know what's gone wrong, but the last 20 minutes of the clip are all like that there. Some bits even more screeching. But all I did was really say what I'm going to do in the video, but it has probably been be a day since that those last clips so this is all I've done so far I've got furnace smelting up some lovely kelp here this was a little auto farm we did at the end of the video so just simply just AFK it not too efficient and two little melon uh, melon par farms here a whole lot of cocoa bean farms and I discovered that we actually can't sell cocoa beans at the store which sucks and we have got quite a large area up here for our nether warts. And I just did create a little very inefficient farm down here for our sugar cane. Because the top layer doesn't actually get what harvest. But on the server it all piles up. And then down here we have got ourselves a little wheat farm. Our sugar cane farm is starting to come along. And all of this is claimed so it's all protected. And we've got ourselves a little... Uh, what would you call this? A hang on, what's it called? Seaweed. Seaweed. We have got ourselves a kelp farm. That's what it's called in this game. 
So I created this uh, just below the farm, so then we've at least got some form of like, I suppose kelp. We need kelp for burning and stuff in that. And hopefully I can run along the top and just pick it all up. Hopefully it will work out. And with all that kelp harvested, I'm just going to chuck it in here and it's going to slowly make its way through the system and get smelted up. And then with this, we can craft ourselves some dried kelp and that can go into here and be used for furnaces. But to end off today's video, we're going to warp vote. I think it's called. Warp crates, is it? Warp crates. And we're going to get rid of these seven voting keys that we have accumulated, which is pretty good because we reached 500 just before over here. As soon as we reach 500, we get given five keys and you get given keys when you vote. So let's go ahead and see what we will get. Hopefully we get something good. What? Did you give me something then? We've got ourselves a ghast here. Let's put that in. And put that one in. We've got a parrot spawn egg. Oh, it quits out straight away. Okay. Got two parrot, a parrot spawn egg. And we've got two ghast tiers. So far, so good. We've got ourselves some eight sponges so we can clear out some area down below. I would like to get some more lovely slime blocks so we can do some little auto farms with that there. Come on, give me something good. Eight slime blocks, perfect. Let's go in and just quit out straight away. Oh, we've got a horse and saddle, perfect. And let's see what else we're going to get. Something good. Uh, some more sponges. So let's go home, home. And then we will be working on, in the next video, working on getting the farm improved, getting a bigger smelter set up, getting some mining done from the mining world, and we will also will be working P-Warp Grind. And this is my shop here, which we're slowly working on with the little hovering things, which took me a very, quite a long time to figure out how they actually work. I've forgotten how they work now, sadly. And I'm hoping our sign shops come in. And we've got a little room on the side here, which is going to feature. So you go P Warp Atlantis. And this Atlantis is a build and it's an underwater city. So P Warp Turtle, it's a shop, it's mob eggs, and it's owned by M -M -M Minecraft 14. And yeah, that's how it all goes. It's just a very simple roof that's got no bits missing there. That will do for now. But that is all I have got time for today, people. I hope you enjoyed watching the start of my survival series on the SMP server on Skycade. And well, yeah, there might be a few more clips coming out. And then coming out will be an hour-long Skyrim episode very shortly. So I hope you guys all enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time on Minecraft. Hopefully it's on my survival world. I'm just waiting for the replay mod to come out. And I'll see you guys next time. And cue that outro.